Hi, and this is a quick, um, let's say, talk about some of the technology that we're showing today at Prince 2020 and 2022. So this is the conference that's um, happening in Ulu in Finland. And so the first thing I'm going to do is dive into some of the technologies that we are um, showing and we are talking about. So, for example, at Zimmer and Peacock, we're developers of um, biosensors and printed electrodes. So here it's very um, small, let's say, but in fact, at the heart of this, there's a printed um, electrode and a printed biosensor. And it's within a microfluidic um, cartridge. And you can see that that cartridge then clicks into a device. I'm just gonna ask the camera to step back a bit because what I'll show you is this device is designed to actually collect my breath and do analysis on the breath. So if we come back in now and have a look at it, you can see that what makes Zimmer and Peacock extremely unusual is the fact that we do do the thick film printing of electrodes, for example, or vapor deposition of electrodes. And as I've previously shown, that is in the heart of these um, cartridges. But Zimmer and Peacock is different because in fact, we've then had to develop the entire um, let's say set of electronics um, that actually drives all of this. So obviously there's, you know, there's batteries in here, there's power management in here, there's PLTA devices in here, there's sensors for measuring um, breath, um, um, for example. So at Zimmer and Peacock, yeah. though we do do printed electronics, it's really just the start of what we're doing. And in fact, then we have to do build um, enzymes on top of those electrodes, microfluidics on top of those electrodes, um, electronics on top of those electrodes. So now I'm going to show you something quite different now. So for scale, this looks very different. But when you actually look at it, again, there's an electrode system. And so our key science of electrochemistry is at the heart of this again. And what this is, is a nitrate rod for um, measuring nitrate in the soil. So this is planted to a depth and then the nitrate sensors are in the soil constantly measuring the nitrate. So that's a very different looking technology, but um, the same sort of key science. Now at Zimmer and Peacock as well, I'll just show you very quickly. We can make the electronics um, very small. So we have a printed um, electrode, very small electronics, and we can run this um, off a smart device like this. So you can see that we can actually make a very um, low cost um, point of care type device. For some applications, similar electronics, but a larger, let's say, box. Now I'm gonna change gears slightly now and start talking about wearables. So when I talk about wearables, um, this will be too small for the camera, but these are micro needles. And these ones are actually quite large. These ones are actually smaller. So these are micro needles and are designed to be transdermal um, electrodes that can go through the skin. As part of that capability, we also have, and this is two generations of the same product, these are wire sensors. So I have talked about us doing printed electronics and vapor deposition. We also make these wire sensors, which can actually go transdermal and they're used in continuous lactate, um, CGM, or continuous glucose monitoring type applications. So what I'll do now is step back. And in fact, just before I step back, if you're wondering how small the electronics can get for these kind of devices, then you can see that this, um, PCB, this analog front end, which is unpopulated, is very small. So we'll step back and we'll do a summary now. So I apologize for the background noise, but we're at um, this conference and we've talk, we're talking about our in vitro diagnostic technologies and um, our wearable technologies. And Zimmer and Peacock is an ISO 13485 contract developer and contract manufacturer of electrochemical biosensors and in vitro diagnostics. And if you have any questions, please reach out to us. Thank you very much.